I have to pass both of them tests. Why? Because I'm failing. But y'all know agency nursing is not all I do. I work full time at a clinic Monday through Friday. So that's where I get the bulk of my income from. And then agency nursing is just like supplemental income. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sheena Legal. If you're not new here, welcome back. Y'all, today is... What's the day? Today is Sunday, July the 7th. It's early. What time is it? 10 a.m.? It ain't that early, but I've been up for a minute. Y'all, my legs are so sore. I did an at-home leg workout yesterday, and I'm feeling it in my thighs today. Like, it's so sore, so sore. But anyways, y'all... I was gonna say so I don't know what I'm gonna do today like I have a major test I think some of y'all been following along with me I had started back to school and y'all I have to pass so I have one more day left of this class and we have two tests I have to pass both of them tests why because I'm failing um I thought I was ready, but shoot this fast pace. So I've been like studying all weekend. And so I have to pass these last two tests. So today I'm actually going to get some studying in. I don't know if I'm going to meet up with my study partner or do it on my own. But I've been reading and listening to the lectures all weekend because I have to study. I have to study. I got to pass. But other than that, y'all, I don't know what else is on my plate. Lately, I've been feeling like I'm in a funk. Like I really really don't know i know what it is i just feel like have you ever like just feel <clears throat> like you want so much out of life or yeah that's what it is and then it's like i feel like at this age that i am i feel like i should be so much further in life then i start thinking about like different choices that i have made like over time like Wow, I should have probably made a different choice. Should have probably made a different choice. You know, and so on and so on. Which I can't hold that over my head because we live and we learn. I guess you could say it like that. But y'all, I think that's another reason why I've been down in the funk. And then also, <clears throat> I don't know if these, y'all know I said in one of my vlogs, uh, I picked up these Adapex. I'm going to start taking these Adapex. And I really think they've just been having a toll on my mood too. So, I ain't taking one a day. I'm going to see. But the, if y'all don't know, Adipase is like an appetite suppressant. Yeah, I don't know about that. <clears throat> but anyways, y'all, I'm just trying to see what I'm going to be doing today because I got a lot. I need to really just study. And y'all, another reason why I've been depressed. I, I call it depressed. I don't even want to claim it though. But I sold my Jeep. I love my Jeep. I wanted to sell it. Uh, um, it's because like I've been having like some su suspension problems. I kept having to fix the same stuff over and over. I've been having my Jeep forever, and I sold my Jeep. And I wanted to sell it, but after I sold it, I just found this this sense of emptiness in me. And it's like, dang, it's almost like losing somebody, you know? Like, which I need to. Get away from that. Just being attached, you know, to the same stuff, to the same thing. Like, stop getting so attached to the people and things, you know. Change is good. So, I was like, Shana, don't regret it because I always tell myself your stories I already wrote. So, whatever is happening is meant to happen for other things to happen. So, I got a good amount for my Jeep, y'all. <clears throat> and then, like, I just sold it and, you know, I got a very good amount for my Jeep. Um, but now I have to figure out what car I'm getting next. So we're going to figure that out. Or y'all probably see it in the vlog. I've been looking at some cars or whatever. I'm not sure if I want to just take the money that I got from my Jeep and buy my car cash. Get a note. I don't know yet. So I just been having it on my mind. Just thinking what I'm going to do. You know, um, one of the things I thought about doing was like just buying a car. Y'all know I usually, um, help with, um, uh selling used cars or whatever but 
I was like, if I buy a car to sell, just drive it into a sale, make a profit, put that profit up, do it again, put that profit up, do it again. Basically, let that buy my car and I sit on my money. I don't know, I got like so much going through my head. But first things first, y'all got to get done with this class and I must pass. Like, I have never failed. <laughs> I have never failed. So, like, I really have to crack down on that. And I need to study. So, I may end up, my, my uh friend, my study partner, he been hitting me up all weekend. And I haven't been going. Like, I just haven't been in that mode. And I'm trying to get out of it. Trying to break the mold, but I'm just like, I, I don't know. I just be getting so frustrated because it's like, dang, I want to do so much, but it feel like I'm not getting anything done. And so, like, um, it's this book. It's called, what is it called? Outwittling the Devil or something like that. I have to get that book because I heard that book was basically about um, a different thoughts and the different stuff that go through your mind that hinder you from reaching your goals or make you feel like you're not enough to reach your goal that's just kind of what i heard that the book is about and so i'm ready to get my hands on that book because i feel like a lot of thoughts and all of that even like depression like different stuff like that is just the devil getting in the way of you reaching your goal so it's basically how to maneuver and avoid and think positive for success so i cannot wait to get that book because i need it because it's like y'all want to do so much i need my youtube to blow up yeah my passion a long time ago was doing hair like if i could start back doing at least sewings i think that would kind of put me where i need to be i went to my nephew's uh birthday dinner and his dad which is my sister ex-husband He's doing so good. He a barber and he's doing so good. And he was just like, I remember a long time ago, Shannon, you were saying you want to do her. I did. That was my passion. But I went towards nursing. And then his sister was like, you know why you probably did that? I was like, wow. She was like, you probably was scared. You were scared that you weren't going to make it. And I'm like, you know, prob probably so. Because, you know, if I would have been a beautician... Then that would have been like more of me having to grind, hustle, build my clientele. And then with nursing, of course, you go hit these people clock and you make your money. So I was looking at more security at the time, you know. And that was way, what, about 10 years ago when I made the decision? Because I was either like, okay, should you go to nursing school or you go to beauty college or cosmetology? And so, like, I was like, man, I really wish I would have went the other route. Which I say it ain't too late, but y'all, I'm getting old. And that's another thing I be thinking about. Like, at this age, I thought I would be in a different position, you know? But anyways, what else? Oh, yeah, and then I wanted to start, like, a legging line. Y'all, y'all know I love wearing leggings. So I really want to start my own legging line. Yeah, I want to start my own legging line. So I really been looking into that, but I'm like, I need to either find a class or something. I need to know like where I kind of know where to get vendors from, but I need to like look deeper into that. But I'm like, I could do that probably after my class. Like I have to pass these tests in this class. So I'm like, okay, I need to make me a list. That's probably what I do. I'll probably go to the store, give me like a notebook and write down all of what I need to do and how I'm going to reach it. And what else? Uh, and then, of course, YouTube. YouTube. I need YouTube to blow up, too. You know? And, yeah. So, that's pretty much where my mind been at lately. Like, I just, like... I don't know. I don't know. I just... I really wish I could just... See, I have children, so I'm a little bit more stable. But if I, would, if I didn't have children, I probably would pick myself up and move and just start over and just start fresh. But, like, with my children, I try to have them as stable as possible with school and all of that. But I'm really thinking about making some major changes because I have to clear my mind, get focused, and, yeah, all of that. So, anyway, y'all, if you watching, comment down below some encouraging words, some supportive 
words or whatever to get me through because yeah that's just how i've been feeling lately but i decided to pick up the camera because i'm like Shannon, how you want to be a successful youtuber but you ain't picking your camera up pick your camera up so i did that so that's good that's good for me because lately i just been in my zone in the house anyway so yeah let me see what i'm gonna do next what we finna do i need to go by my job and print out some of the review questions because i did listen to my lectures and so i'm like if i print out some of the review questions then i can try to go over them and me writing them will help me to retain some of this information so like i said we got two tests in one day and it's the last day of class so i got to pass both of them tests So we finally in the car now. Hey, my battery gonna die. <sighs> Shoot. Anyways, we finna head to the pool. Yeah, it take a lot for us to go somewhere. They done lost the key, found the key. Hell, junk everywhere. It's hot. Try to let the sun go down a little bit. Maybe, maybe once we get in there and I get to settle, drinking my cold water, I'll cool off. Hey, and y'all, when I, huh? It's a study or listen to this junk again y'all cannot wait to get done with this place because it's so annoying and the junk just crazy what we learn and it's very it's not interesting it's words i never heard of before yeah, it's just kind of crazy y'all hot no i have been but it's gonna be the pool it's gonna be cool it should be I love when we get in the pool. Well, uh, yeah, in a pool area. Anyways, we made it to the pool, and they are, there ain't really nobody in here. I think it's, what, three other people, so they kind of got the whole pool to themselves. And I will, you know what, I'm just going to do questions, because I was going to listen to the lecture, but then I was going to sleep. I'm not going to sleep out here because it's super hot. <laughs> but, in a minute, Mariah. In a little bit. Anyways, what, Jay? Hello, how are you? We're going to deep end. Y'all going to deep end. Make sure you put your life jacket on. Huh? Make sure you put your life jacket on. Uh, 
I was eating some broccoli and some some uh, bok choy cabbage. That looks hot, y'all. But anyways, y'all, it's been like a lot of questions about uh, the nursing, the agency, and all of that. So I think I'm gonna do like a sit down video, just showing y'all like what, Marie? Let's go. Okay, just showing y'all like how, like what um, I do to book my shifts. And y'all, I literally, I literally need to be. I thought about it when I went to sleep, y'all. I need to at least work one shift a week. If I work one shift a week with the agency, that's like an extra $250 to $500 depending on if it's a 12-hour shift or if it's a 8-hour shift and how much they pay it. So, but I'm just saying at least one. Of course, I can do more than one, but like I've been lazy. I hope this computer is not dead. Anyways, um, I had talked to my sister. She wants to go to get late night petties tonight, but I'm like, they overpriced. And she was like, you know what? I can do it myself. So I'm trying to save. I'm like, me too. Y'all see, I got on my press songs. I don't really like them, but it's okay. I'm gonna start getting me like different press songs to try because like my acrylic nails are literally be coming out way too fast. I get on it. I was talking about uh, nursing, but I was just saying I'm gonna make a sit down dedicated video on like the agency that I use, what I look for in the shifts, um, how I book my shifts, and then take out with me. And I am gonna try to start picking up more. But y'all know agency nursing is not all I do. I work full time at a clinic Monday through Friday, so that's where I get the bulk of my income from. And then agency nursing is just like supplemental income. But it's good income. It's good. <laughs> but yeah, um, I was just telling my sister, I'm just like, we need to go on another trip. So I'm thinking, she, I told her I'm going to come over after we leave the pool. And so we're just going to be looking up a trip or something. A quick getaway because I legit be at home bored. Bored out of my mind. Yeah. That's what we gonna do. But anyways, y'all, it's hot out here. I'm finna uh, do these review questions. And then I'm gonna chill. And then I think I'm gonna pick y'all up when we leave the pool. Oh, y'all, my thighs hurt so bad. It's hot out here. I'm trying to think what else we can talk about. I, I know I can't wait to get done with this class for sure. For sure, for sure, y'all. And if y'all know, if y'all ever started your own business or if you know anything about vendors, y'all, I'm looking for a vendor because I'm trying to start my own legging line. And I need to request some samples so that I can start wearing them so I know exactly what I want in my leggings. Um, so yeah, that's my next goal. Actually, we need to write down some of our goals because I got a lot of stuff that I want to do. So I need to write all of that down so I won't feel like I have all this stuff in my head and I'm not getting nowhere. Yeah, I'm hot. I don't know how I'm looking over there, but I'm so freaking but anyways, y'all, I'm going to pick y'all up in a second. Look at there they go. I'm talking about I know, I'm going to record you in a minute. Hi, See guys. how empty the pool is? Guys, I'm coming <laughs> over to you. So Swim, Jay. Huh? Swim. I don't know how. Try. I am not going to walk.
Swim under the water too. Okay, that's enough. Okay, y'all, so we done left the pool and we done made it over to my sister's house. I'm about to eat. I just why I have to come to eat it. I hate to cook. I really don't cook that much. But my sister loves to cook, so. Is your hair that wet? Jay, did you have to be going to tell? It's not happening. It's mine. No, it's kind of it's supposed to be like a red color, but it didn't come out so good. I'm not feeling this color. I'm gonna take this down. Yeah. I really want some curly hair. So I'm gonna try some what? curly hair. What? Yeah. It ain't gonna dry that quick. Eat first, then you can get the blow dry. Let's see what she got in here. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she got some tostados and all the stuff to go on it. Well, so what I need was. I looked at the internet just because I wanted something with more than just beans and cheese. Remember when we was in Mexico, I ordered one? Oh, that was so good. So good. Oh, I do not like this. And my part, I don't know what happened to my part. It was just in the way. Yeah, here go my two stars. I'm weak. You so weak. My little son, I'm weak. Yeah, you, you Gina got a daughter for real. Who <laughs> told my mom used to make them taco sandwiches and stick it in the oven? It's good. It's too big to put in my mouth. Yeah, I had one of these when I was in Mexico. Oh, it's so good. Hold on, Mm. 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 